Step 6. Creating and editing a profiled wall. Activate the 5.6.1 point creating profiled wall preset view in the navigator. The 2D profile of the bench appears on the screen. Just copy this element to the Profile Manager Settings dialog box. Select the fill forming the cross section and click the Copy command. Open Design, Complex Profiles, Profile Manager. Click New and paste the copied fill. Reposition the fill as shown. In ARCHICAD, you can apply a custom profile to any selected element in the model window on a one-time basis without having to save it as an attribute. Close the Profile Editor window. Go to the 3D window by switching on the 5.6.2 point Adding Profiled Wall in the 3D preset view. Pick up the longitudinal wall's parameters by clicking on one of them while holding down the Alt key. Open the Wall Settings dialog box and choose the Exterior Furniture layer. Set the wall height to 5 meters. You don't need to specify all the settings now. The profile and the parameters will be set later. Select the curved circumference geometry method in the info box. Add some profiled walls to the project as shown. Change the reference line position as necessary. Now, select the previously created walls and click the Apply to Selection button in the Profile Manager window. As you can see, the profile of the elements have changed. Close the Profile Manager window. An alert appears on the screen mentioning that a complex profile is currently opened. You do not need this profile anymore, so click the Don't Store button. Don't forget that it's possible to further modify the placement or form of these elements using the pet palette on the floor plan or in the 3D window. Also, try using the Edit Reshape menu commands. Select a curved wall and activate the Edit, Reshape, Split command. Draw a temporary splitting line in the 3D window and click on one of the sides. Elements on the clicked side will remain selected while elements on the other side will be deselected. Repeat the operation. As an alternative, you can activate the split icon in the standard toolbar. Finally, delete the unnecessary parts of the wall.